Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to the vlog. If you're new to the channel, a big warm welcome. My name is Tristan Mortlock. This is Captain's Vlog. We are in Via Reggio on a very, very wet day. Uh, it is Saturday morning. It's about 7.30 a.m. And we have two vans arriving, or two trucks better said, with all the furniture, interior and exterior for the boat to be put back on board, to be put in its place and to bring AWOL back to life and ready for the 2019 charter season. So they should be arriving in the next hour or so. All the team are gonna be helping out bringing all the furniture on board. For now it has stopped raining. I'm hoping it's gonna stay that way. The forecast saying only a 40% chance of rain uh, later this morning. So fingers crossed it remains that way. And um, yeah, and then eventually once we're all on board, you guys get to see a wall kind of getting back into its into her summer glory so um let's uh let's go and check it out As you can see, they're getting ready for a boat show here in Via Reggio. They're, getting, they're erecting all the uh, all the tents. And the boat show will be starting on Monday next week, so we'll be out of the port um, by Monday. To the final sea trial, that should go well, and then from there, we'll be heading to Genoa, finalising the preparation of the boat. We'll be bunkering fuel. I'm going to show you guys the bunkering process and. Uh, Looking forward to starting our first chart of the season. Okay, it's the afternoon now and the wind's picked up a bit. I couldn't film entirely at the, the emptying of the truck, we were just too, too busy. But as you can see, we've got the sun deck furniture. It's all kind of under the shade here because tonight we're expecting rain. We've got the four, the sun deck uh, sunbed. Again, it's been covered. Uh, it's under that, you can see. They still got to put the clips on here for these straps, which they're going to do tomorrow on Sunday. While detailing, you can see, for example, all the little detail, all the silicone around here needs to be cut. You know, so today the the surveyor and I have been going around, and Barbara, have been going around all the little details that they got to correct to make it 100% perfect and to you know the super yacht standards, whatever that means, because it's not a real thing. Um, you know, for example, like here, you can see the second fence line is not perfect. So they're going to come clean all of this, make sure it's a complete straight line there. Um, we'll come and make our way down to the bridge deck aft. Seat's looking nice and shiny now. We got all the sofas back in place, uh, cushions all back in place. These kind of need a bit of a clean, had a bit of a dirty rain. Uh, they need to clean this teak deck again. <laughs> they did a really poor job here, but uh, hopefully they'll, uh, well, not hopefully they'll have to improve it. Um, barbecue. Thing in there needs a bit of organizing, but this is fantastic barbecue here, gas barbecue. And then we need to do a four wash down. We'll probably be doing two or three wash downs, all the details. And then we've got like cut lines of the paint. So I don't know if you can see, like here, we've got the cut lines. So then what they need to do is a very, very fine sand line, maybe like a 1500 or 2000. Just go over that and just polish that up. And uh, these are the bimini covers. So these basically are like the sun shades, which hook onto here. And then from here, they go onto these stainless steel stanchions here. So then the guests, when they're using this area, can also choose to be uh, in, the, in the shade. Make our way down to the main deck. All the main deck furniture back in place. Again, needs a bit of a clean organizing. It's all covered up. And then we'll make our way, we'll make our way forward. Uh, so it's actually quite a nice feeling having everything back on board, all the cushions back in their place. Uh, it's not last bit, we still actually have another week before the charter. So um, it's going to be more than ready for our first guest of the season, which I'm very excited to have on board. So you can see all the sun cushions are in place. These are the poles for the uh, sunshade when we're at anchor. The forward sunbed is in place, again covered up because we're expecting rain tonight. And then things like you can see here, there's just bits and little bits and bobs everywhere, which is going to be all cleaned up. All the stainless steel is going to get polished up professionally. All the little, you can see like the small little details 
um, it's a bit frustrating you know like here like glue and things like that you know just to get it back to its uh, you know very high standards that we have that we carry here on a wall um, you can see from here not looking too bad paints looking nice very very good very happy with that um, it's just details you know you've got to have a very good eye for these things and you know sometimes these companies miss things so the more time we spend aboard going around and around we're finding more and more stuff that they need to correct and um, they're, they're happy to oblige which is great and yeah uh, let's go and see what the guys are doing in the garage they're packing that up let's go and see what toys we have What's happening? It's tidying up a little bit. All right, so we have the old um, weight board. Sea bobs in those big cardboard boxes is the jet surfs. It's a never good idea to store cardboard on board a vessel because that's where bugs and stuff uh, lay their eggs. So that, that'll be off next week. Slavin's doing a little repair in there. What's happening, Sly Dog? Sly Dog repaired the, the lights. Doing some electrical work, yes. organizing, yeah. making, uh, waterproof. making waterproof. Uh, so these are the sea bobs. These things are really cool. They basically go underwater. They do like 20k an hour. The F5s. They're not. They're not cheap. I think these go for like seven, eight grand each. It's pretty expensive. In here, in here, the electric jet surfs. These are the battery packs for the electric jet surfs. Those are pretty cool. They do about 25 kilometers per hour. With a mono fin. Uh, we've got the two fold-up bicycles, we've got the skis, a couple pool noodles over there, we've got the fishing rods, and yeah, as you can see, uh, if I'm taking the carpet off in here, so uh, Jason yesterday was cleaning inside, so it's all looking good. Well, looking a lot better than it was, for that way. We've got some gym equipment, that's uh, for the spinning bike that goes on the sun deck when uh, the guests want to use it. In these black bags here, we've got the uh, paddle boards and canoes. Uh, where are the paddles actually? Uh, they're underneath the sea bobs. Ah, so here we've got the handles. These are all the paddles, the paddle boards and the canoes. We've got the privacy shade here. We've got the deck chairs that we set up on the, on the sorry, the dock chairs we set up on the dock. A couple of uh, Buoyancy aids there, they're not called life jackets, they're called buoyancy aids. So we're getting there, we're getting there. All looking a lot better than it was last week. They've installed a new seal, it's a brand new seal here, or gasket, whatever you want to call it, around the transom door. They put the inner um, cover, which is the covering the access to the name lights. So yeah, we're pretty much getting there now, so i um, very happy. Let's go and see what's happening on the interior. No. Oh my God, what's happening in here? Okay. Oh, I've got to show you, come on. I can't believe my crew has closed the door on me, can you believe that? It's not Captain Ready. It's not Captain Ready. Hello. Who's this? Hello. Ciao, Look Baba Rack. <laughs> it's fantastic, the word is perfect. Come back in one week. <laughs> Oh my god, no. <laughs> so, this is a before, guys. You'll see in a week's time, I'm going to do a tour for all you viewers, and it's going to be absolutely tip top. Isn't that right, Jivanator? Well, now that we have our new rug, I think. Brand new rug. Jivanator's brand. Surprise for all the viewers. Surprise to come. Yep. So, a lot of these, these are majority exterior cushions, right? Uh, half and half. Half and half. So these are all the exterior and interior cushions, so you guys can see. The amount of sunbeds, sofas, beds that we have on board. Got a bit of music going. That's good. This will this will probably take a, all the cushions take normally around half a day between all the crews. So not too worried about that. David slamming the door. Um, so basically, I get the feeling. This uh -huh. box that was engineering interior, I get the feeling Slavin doesn't want it anymore, but I've got no way in my it was from previous. It's all like, um, like the logs and little pieces and stuff. Yeah. 
Okay. I just wanted to add something. If you're new to the channel, yes, please subscribe because you definitely want to see the next chapter because you need to see that boat gets ready. Please, <laughs> please. And like. <laughs> Hello, Michaela. <laughs> uh, that person was uh, Nikada, the new second stew. She's quite camera shy, um, but we'll get her on the, on the channel and maybe an upcoming video. So guys, that's the update for now. Um, next video, we'll be doing the sea trial with Caterpillar, the main engine sea trial. We'll be testing the new tune propellers, which I know a lot of you are waiting to see. And once we get the two thumbs up, we'll be heading to Genoa Birth in general for four or five days before I pick up in uh, uh, in the port there and then start our first charter. Can I show, so, can I show something? Barbara wants to show you guys something. No, it's just because it's difficult to imagine now. You need to have a little bit of imagination. Like for example, what is this? Oh, you can have a baby on board. It's gonna be safe. <laughs> what is this? Oh, you can have a picnic on the beach. This is gonna be so fun. This is the picnic box for the chase. Do you wanna open it up and have a look? Oh, yeah. So this goes on the chase boat. So what we do is a beach setup for the guests. See? So this is, this is chart already. <laughs> Enjoy it. See, you want to have a nice picnic on the beach with the chase boats? No problem. See? Thank you very much. So you just need a bit of imagination and then you will understand that like everything is just ready. But it's not on the right place yet. For example. <laughs> what's, what's that for, Jiminator? <laughs> Good. Right guys, don't forget to click that like button. If you haven't done already, please do subscribe to the channel. Uh, but from all the team and I, it's goodbye for now. We'll see you guys in probably a day or two uh, for our next video for the sea trial. So see you then.